Hi, I'm Dr. Aarti Alva and I'm the ENT specialist at Asta Clinic, Abu Shagara, Sharjah. Today, I would like to talk to you about throat pain or as patients sometimes call it, sore throat. Sore throat or pharyngitis as we doctors like to call it is one of the most common complaints which brings a patient to the ENT OPD. Patients come in varying degrees of distress. Some might have just a mild itch or irritation in the throat. Some will come with moderate discomfort which allows them to eat or drink but with difficulty. Some come with severe throat pain which doesn't allow them to swallow even their own saliva. At the other end of the spectrum, we have patients who come with uh, a choking or a block sensation in the throat. They don't really have pain but still they're unable to eat. Uh, so as you can see there are various causes of throat pain and today I'm just going to be giving you a very broad overview of some of them. One of the most common causes of throat pain is infection and usually it is viral in nature. It has been documented that in 80% of children who present to a clinic with throat pain the cause is viral. In adults this number is even higher with 90% of adults presenting with viral infection. So what this means is that patients do not require antibiotics for every case of throat infection. Uh, viruses do not respond to antibiotics, only bacteria do. Okay? So the treatment for viral pharyngitis is usually symptomatic. Uh, Painkillers or analgesia for the pain, lozenges or oral sprays. Hydration is the main factor which has to be uh, kept in mind. Um, for deciding, before we decide if a patient requires antibiotics or not, there are certain criteria which a doctor will follow, such as the streptococcal score. And uh, based on these uh, parameters, we decide, yes, this patient would benefit most from antibiotic, this patient would not benefit from an antibiotic. Uh, to clinch the diagnosis, sometimes we even can do blood tests or even a throat culture. With or without treat treatment, throat pain should resolve in 7 to 10 days. In case it doesn't, please visit or revisit your doctor.